Welcome to John's Guitar Lab. We'll talk about turnarounds today and give you a few examples and some chord progressions that you could practice as what we call a turnaround. <clears throat> Pardon me. Uh, remember way back when we did the doo-wop chords for one, six, four, five? C, A minor, F, G. That actually, and what they say, one, six, four, five, the C is the one chord, the A minor is the six chord, the F is the four chord, the G is the five chord. Just a number system. And by the way, in the not too distant future, I'll be doing a complete uh, set of videos, you know, two or three, just on, you know, the, the chords, their relations, major, minor, and how you figure out the, the notes using a scale. Right? And again, don't panic. You don't have to be a theory expert on this, but you do need to know arithmetic. Anyway, back to this. One, six, use this as you're ending a song, you know, uh, it ain't gonna rain no more, no more, it ain't gonna rain no more, how the heck can the old man tell, it ain't gonna rain no more, it ain't, again, maybe that's not the best place to put it, but that's gonna be up to you, but that's what I mean by the turnaround, you're at the end of the tune, and you're gonna come back to the beginning of the tune. Here we did one, six, four, five. Why not also we could do one, six, two, D minor, you hear that? Five. Now we're in the first position. Let's take the bar chords. It's with the D minor. Listen to it with the F chord. C, A minor. chord, D minor, just to add a little color, that's all we're doing, all right, if we're in the key of G, E minor, or G, E minor, A minor, D, or D7. Back to the key of C. C, A minor, D minor, G7. Here, so you take the what we call the 1, 6, 2, 5, 1, 6, 4, 5, and you just sort of work that out, listen to the sound. Here, when we're in G, if you want, you could go G, E minor here. You could go G, E minor. A minor, D7. And just change so, so you hear the different colors that the, the guitar, the different sounds that the guitar makes. And that's all it is, just a brief thing on what we call a turnaround. One, six, four, five, or that you have the one six two five and i think i did this in the last video with the c you could do they have the c sharp diminished d minor g g7 again c and we remember the c sharp diminished the d minor now can you use the c sharp diminished with the f yeah, but the reason I like the D minor is that if you hit the bass, so it's 
instead of strumming, what am I doing? Just a few little tidbits, all right? If you enjoyed this, please give me that thumbs up and subscribe so we can get more of this stuff out there. As always, any questions in the comments below. Enjoy your day. Have fun with this. Don't get crazy. If it's something you're not sure of, as I said, you give me some questions, I'll be more than happy to break it apart, write it up on the board with my wonderful handwriting. All right, <laughs> enjoy your day.